It's game day. we got a big game today, Vanderbilt versus Kentucky. Vanderbilt, one of the worst teams in the SEC. They are 4-3, and three, but they've had some really, really bad losses. Leading scorer is Scottie Pippen's son. If you don't know who Scottie Pippen is, you must not know basketball. Michael Jordan's, you know, one-two punch. He's his son. He's averaging over 20 a game. He's pretty good, to say the least. You saw Dante Allen, the way he played against Mississippi State. That gives you hope. Can Dante play that way again? I mean, Dante hit seven threes. He brought a spark. No Terrence Clark again. So Dante's going to have a lot of playing time tonight. Let's go, Cats. Tonight could be a big night. Go, Cats. Let's go. Very ugly start. Four to four early. No shots going down for really either team so far. Sar, he goes in. Goes right to Jackson. Jackson goes up strong. And Isaiah through the contact gets it to go. Not an and one, but that's Isaiah Jackson's first bucket of the night. 6-4 cat. 10-7 here. Sar puts up a three. He's off the mark. Rebound there by Jackson on the tip out. Pull out for Mintz. Mintz gets one to fall. Big shot there by Mintz. Cats by six. Dante Allen checks in for his first little bit of action. Gives it to Mintz. Cats trying to extend an early lead here and play with some freedom. Mintz wants to attack. Not a great look there. That's off the mark. Tip out. No. Here comes Pippen in transition. He goes up and under through. No. What a play by him. Great fast break point. Leading score for Vandy for a reason. Dante Allen puts one up. His first shot of the game, and he gets it to fall. Pippen's going fast in transition. Vanderbilt down three, but on a little bit of a run here. He takes Askew to the paint. Goes, kicks out. Pump fake, good move there. Kick out. Three ball for Vandy. Gets it to go. Hit every part of the rim. But Vanderbilt shooting the lights out so far from deep. 17-17. Tie game early on. Pippen Jr. has been taking Dante Allen the last couple of possessions. Let's see if he does it again. Lux wants to kick to the corner. Can't find find it there. Gets the ball off the handoff. Boom. Takes Sauron now. Gets fouled and gets it to go to count the bucket. He's the real deal. Has a chance to give Vanderbilt an early lead. Tie game early here. Still been very, very sloppy. Defensive possessions been, or side of the ball has been great both sides. BJ Boston gets sucked in too far, and Vanderbilt's gonna knock down a three. Six nine shooter knocks him down. Didn't look at the scouting report there. Vanderbilt up six, putting it to Kentucky, out hustling them. Just everything that you've seen out of Kentucky this year. Pippen Jr. He goes to the rack. He's gonna get one for two. They extended to an eight-point lead. Vanderbilt trying to get a stop here on their eight-nothing run. Trying to extend the lead if they can get a stop. BJ Boston, he rips through. He goes through the layup. He finally makes his first basket of the game. Only took him 19 minutes. Nine-point lead. BJ jumps the pot passing lane. He takes one. He goes up with the layup. He gets it to fall. He's showing effort finally. Kentucky down seven. Trying to go into half down seven against Vanderbilt. Unreal. No good there. Dante Allen with it. So Kentucky comes out on a quick little 3-0 run. Tries to extend it here. Or more than 3-0, excuse me. 5-0. Saar now jab step puts one up. Saar ties it up. The energy's changed here. Kentucky playing with a little more heart. Tie game. Lance Ware gets a technical or a flagrant one for a hit to the face. So Kentucky gets on a 7-0 run to start the half and shoots themselves in the foot. And this is going to be a five to seven point swing. Unreal. Two point Vanderbilt lead here. Kentucky looks sloppy and they still do. Trying to tie this back up. It hasn't been tied for a while. Seeing if they can or take their first lead in a very long time. They go to Askew. Askew's going to attack the lane. He looks, rips through, lay up, gets it to go. And we got a tie ball game. Good move there by Devin to get through the screen. Flies through the lane. Easy two. Kentucky up one here. Could extend. Ask you kick out to BJ Boston. BJ rip through. BJ. That's been BJ all year. Wow, that was awful. Here comes Pippen in transition. That's a goaltending on top, and Vanderbilt takes their lead back. Horrible shot by BJ on one end, leads to a bad goaltend on the other. Jeez. Four point game. Vanderbilt trying to expand this. Kentucky's offense has just been horrendous. Defense has been pretty good for most of the part, but they attack. That's a block shot. He got hammered. No call. BJ, is he going to come out and out of control? Probably so. Step through. I thought he took three steps. Guess not. Gets the layup to go. Nice little Euro then. Cuts it to two. Two-point lead here. It's been ugly back and forth. I don't know how both teams are in the 60s, but they are. Top and blown by Pippen Jr. What a player this kid is. Gets it from his father. Tie game. ball for Vandy. Touch pass. Knocks it down. The Commodores tie it up. Back and forth we go. Kentucky's defense gets sucked in deep. Vanderbilt's shooting the lights out of the ball tonight, and that's what's kept them in it. 56 seconds tie game. 
What does Kentucky draw up out of that timeout? You cannot afford to lose a game like this. Good play call. Good screen by Toppin. Mitts for three. Gets it to go. Davion from deep. Great play call out of the timeout. Good screen by Toppin. Even better shot by Mitts. Vanderbilt needs to respond. Down three. Pippen. He goes up. Jacob Toppin with the block. Jackson rips it down. He whips it to ask you. Vanderbilt's got a foul. I'll still get the ball back with a, like maybe seven seconds left at most. You got a foul. You're down three. It looks like they're going to pull it off. Jerry Stackhouse's team doesn't want to do it. They bring a high screen with Isaiah Jackson. Ask who uses it. He looks, gets the roll. He doesn't want to use that one. Attacks. Goes to Mitz. Shot clock at 10. He waits. Gets a screen here from Jackson. He sprints. Goes. Dribble handoff. Mitz to the rim. Oh my God, no. Vanderbilt's got a chance for overtime. They push it in transition. Kick. Pump fake. Allen pumps. He goes for it. Three ball. No good. Rebound. Vanderbilt. Kick out. For overtime! One, two, three. Oh, off the rim it goes! Oh my lord! Anybody else's heartbeat flying? What a game! Kentucky looked as ugly as you could. Pull it out. 2 0 in SEC play at the end of the day. Here we go! I mean, no one, nobody said it had to be easy. Oh, Kentucky is something else. It, it's, um,. At the end of the day, you're 2-0 in SEC play. Does it have to be pretty? No. Do they play a level of competition? It's looking that way right now. It truly is. <sighs> that game was something else. We struggled against the worst team in the SEC, Vanderbilt, coming into the year. But to be fair, Vanderbilt's not bad. Pippen Jr., great player. I respect them. You know, they're bigs. They played well tonight. I do think it's interesting. BJ Boston, last two games, Kentucky's one actually has sat down the stretch in the final minutes, the crucial minutes. Big thing to uh, consider. Kentucky goes plays Florida on Saturday at 5 o'clock. Florida just got absolutely boat raced by Alabama. They're going to come out with energy. Kentucky's going to have to play a lot better than they did tonight in Mississippi State. So, hey, 2-0 at the end of the day. Cats win. Not pretty. Let's go.